that's a better start to the video. Like, it ran out of things, I had to delete the video, so then I thought, well, but it made me think further about it. And I just want to explain something to you, right? You know, um, Brother Si, right? Simon Woodford, I'm Andrew Sinclair, right? Another one that's a New World Order show, he's, also, he's called John Collins. He has his name under his banner now, because he's realised that it was getting gangsterist, gangsteresque then, to use names and that. Right? What um, Simon Woodford's tried to give you is a bit of knowledge on symbolism, but like the things that are, are about it. What I've tried to give you knowledge on is sort of like, it'll take you a lot of videos and it'll be really, really hard work, you know what I mean? What Brother John's tried to give you is a grasp on the nature of survival then, right? You know, there's a few comments there like, and uh, John, we're out of touch now, me and Brother John. Never, never talk. I did text me a bit back, like, what I think it didn't matter. And then, like, he just texted me there, like, when I've done an is on an Islam thing, saying, Yeah, it's bang on. Which we've got more videos, and they're all this thing, this way it's running out of space because I've got too much to say. Um, but he's trying to say, like, you know, and it's fair enough, this, you know, you've got a society that you can exist in. If you've got no legs, but if you've got legs, the society might kill you. Also. You see what I mean? Like, this is what I mean. It's a bit like the guy that taught me to her many years ago, he went over to um, India, but Goa, Goa, that was it. So he's here now. Goa and uh, he went and give a kid a, a fucking sweet on the street like that's what I don't know it's all weird really weird shit what he told me like anyway he'd had like a bad tripping over also he charged some fucking you know back in the day like we used to have a few lines of coke and that and uh, he was like this is before I knew him, but like he got over there and had some mad drug what they have in go I don't know what he was. You know what I mean? Like, he didn't know fuck so but like one of these customers like he'd come in and he had a stroke on on that drug in go because he used to get motorbikes and drive on right through go and then go and finish the other day off in um Australia. And they would uh, only work six months a year. Yeah. He was top by the guy what taught me, cut her, like, don't get me wrong, like, not top by, like, top gangster. He was respected, anyway, in his own way, you know what I mean? Oh, yeah, yeah, he'd fight, he'd suck, bottom of the street and back, this fucker. Yeah, he fucking would, yeah, yeah. Then the lads come around, he'd lent his missus a couple of bags, like, and uh, she'd fucked it up, cause she was, like, mad on whiz and that. And uh, he fucking fought one of them up and down the road and the lad went, fuck that, you can't get the fucking fence out of that cunt. I went, I know, I tried to tell him that, like, you know what I mean? Like, and he went, just start lending any more money. Well, they did it one more time, didn't they? Well, she got fucking bottom of the boot right to end the road off my pal. Like, he fucking flirted her, like, fuck, like, you know, because you can't get any sense out of her. The same as the pads couldn't get any sense out of him. These guys that are driving around in Mercedes, like, with laptops on the thing, with a million pounds of a debt going around spreading misery, fucking rape, murder, mystery and drugs and I don't know. So, when these smart asses on the internet, what a fire up, like, you know what I mean? I mean, you, 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 you just don't understand it. You just don't get the picture. It's not... As straightforward as it's a Zionist fucking thing or a Jesuit thing. I believe the Jesuits are high up in the order. And the reason I believe that is because they've got the most money, you see. So I look for the money for the order, but you know, if I'm wrong, I am wrong. You know what I mean? It's like, you know, if you've got uh, an animal that's cornered, it's 
try and look big. So the Jews try and look big because the middle of the Middle East, like you know, it's, it's unfortunate. And then they're nicking bits of fucking land, and it's all kicking off and that. And I, you know what I mean, like. Aye, 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 aye. And then you got Donald Trump saying, oh, I'm sorry, I'll make him split it up, you know. It, is it all a lie? Well, it's all a lie one way or another because, like, if, say, the kid that blew himself up or didn't, then I don't want to argue with anybody at the moment, but the kid that I believe blew himself up, right? The question that I would ask is... Did he know he was about to blow up? You know what I mean? Like, you know. You don't know. You don't understand when I say shit went down. How much I'm saying. Yeah, shit went down. But we don't know the full scripts of it. Because we want not there and we never will. But shit went down. In my opinion. And that's my opinion. I'm feeling like, fuck now, I want to get back on point. Brother John, right, he respects Mason, right? It's run by the Vatican Church, right? No, it's the Jews that run it. But what is it about Mason? What has it brought to the table? It's brought the ability for me to be now broadcasting over the internet, you see. Right? And it's brought everything before it. And it's even brought you, like, stalemates or calm pieces of time, like with Jerusalem, you know. They know no one can ever own it because they'll always want to overthrow it, so they just put a step... A stalemate where no one can move, you know. And the Jews, they're a small race people, and then we can argue about what the Jews are, but what the umbrella of the Jews are like, they're there, chilling.